And with that, sadly, we are out of time for our panel. I really want to thank uh, Robert, Barra and Brianna for an enriching, inspiring and enlightening panel session today. Thank you for sharing all of your thoughts. And also, Brianna, for labelling us all as regular people, no matter who you are, <laughs> what your leadership status everybody's just a regular person surround yourself with good people be consistent and stand up for what you believe in and make a life filled with stories that's what I took from today and um, please carry on the on the conversation on social media and um, we have our hashtags and um, we can keep this conversation going later but for now I would like to introduce our video by Mayor Phil Goff who's going to end our session tonight Nami Hinui. Kia ora tato and, and thanks very much to the panel and for all of you who are participating in the conversation tonight. This year, uh, for the first time in 40 years, I'm not running for elected office, but I know that there are things that I'm going to miss about carrying out the role of mayor and before that um, a long time as a parliamentarian and as a minister. I don't think there's anything more satisfying than being able to go out and represent your community and to make a difference for the better for your community. Uh, it, it's fantastic when you can achieve things that you know are going to be good for the future. For me, it's been things like uh, working on uh, how we can deal with climate change, making sure that we can stop the waste that's been running into our harbour for a century uh, by, by bringing in the infrastructure to ensure that our harbours and our beaches and our streams are clean. It's about being part of an inclusive community, for example, giving the living wage to our council staff. And it's about building the infrastructure so that we can be a world-class city. The, the job of an elected representative um, can be really challenging and demanding, and it can take up as much of your life as you're prepared to give to it. It can sometimes be a bit bruising as well, but most of all, it gives you a chance to give something back to the community that has given so much to us. It gives you the chance to work alongside some really amazing people uh, to make a difference for the future. And that's what I've really enjoyed about it. We want our council and we want our local boards to be truly representative of our community. We want a mixture of ages, of ethnicities, of gender, uh, of some people with experience and some people that are looking at these new challenges with fresh eyes. And if we do that, we strengthen our democracy and we strengthen our ability as members of our community to make a difference and to participate in our community life. So look, don't be put off if you're not experienced. Give it a go. Um, you'll learn from the experience. I've, I, I, I still learn uh, every day from, from what I do as an elected representative. And look, if you don't run uh, or you're not quite ready yet, please do make sure that you find out about the candidates that, that you'll be voting for. Uh, find out what they stand for, what they want to do. Make sure that you, your family and your friends get out and cast your vote and, and help make Auckland a better place for all of us. Uh, nō reira, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā tato katoa. Thank you.